ended up being a very difficult test for you. Were you expecting that type of fight tonight? 首先，恭喜你今天取得了胜利。呃，今天的这个比赛，其实后来好像看的还是打得挺艰难的。这是不是你所预期到的？是的，今天的比赛非常艰难。我知道小南现在非常厉害，然后这两年他进步的非常非常多，他的呃柔术啊，他的这个抓反击的能力非常强。Yeah, this is uh, what's kind of expected because Xiaonan has improved a lot. Uh, not only that she has great striking, also her improvement in grappling, wrestling, um, and she's really good at finding chance to fight back. And she has a very strong desire for fighting. Her strength is unimaginable for women. I think it's really unimaginable. Yeah, also she's so eager to win. And it's just so impressive that female's power can be so incredible. Uh, watching from the outside, I thought for sure the fight was over at the end of the first round. Um, did you think the fight was over at the end of the first round? And if so, how difficult is it to change your mindset to get back into the, the flow of the fight? From the我们旁观者来看，觉得第一局的时候那个罗角已经是小南晕过去了。那么从你这个第一人称的视角来看，你当时觉得自己已经赢了。但是你发现他又起来了，你觉得这个是不是挺难接受的一个过程？对我，我
And just one more for me. In 2019, you were here to fight Tisha Torres on the John Jones, uh, Anthony Smith undercard. And I remember not a lot of people knew who you were. And you were kind of sitting there. And not a lot of media actually spoke to you. Tonight, you were the co-main of UFC 300, one of the biggest cards in the company's history. How do you feel kind of about how you've grown as a martial artist, but also how you've grown in this sport and how people have come to embrace you? 你还记得你2019年的时候比赛 然后我觉得很尴尬，然后我当时跟我的主教练说，我说我一定好好努力，以后有更多的人来采访我，然后今天你看大家都来采访我了。I absolutely vividly remember and in 2019, I was sitting there awkwardly by myself, uh, no one really paid attention to me. All the other fighters getting all the attention, getting interviews, and I was talking to myself like, "Hey, Zhang Weili, you gotta really become a good fighter one day." And one day, everybody want to talk to you, give you attention, and interview you. And, and here we are today. So, thank you. Back here. Um, congratulations on the win. Uh, it, it, the evolution and getting martial arts to mainstream and the Chinese culture goes hand in hand. I mean, the first breakout star was Bruce Lee. Um, you know, how does it feel to be a part of that conversation? Like now the sport is completely mainstream with uh, martial arts and mixed martial arts and being an icon of uh, Chinese martial arts and also uh, mixed martial arts as well. 你知道这个综合格斗就像你说的在中国流行起来时间并不长很多人就是看待结果但是我觉得这个过程我觉得是非常值得学习的就是每一个运动员都非常不容易他们为了去比赛打好的比赛然后去不断的去学习去努力流血流汗也流泪然后我觉得是非常不容易我觉得有的时候
。OK， 我我还想说，就是特别感谢我的教练团队们，然后 Big Wood， 还有我的，还有我的柔术教练，然后他们帮助了我非常非常多，我们在一块合作也非常愉快，然后也感谢 PI 对我的照顾。Um, lastly, I, not, not least, um, I want to say thank you to my coach team. Um, every coach I've been working with, they've been great with me. We had a great re working relationship. Also, thank you, PI, for the support and taking care of me. Thank you, everyone. Thanks, guys.